Welcome back, everybody. I'm sorry. We're going to play some more Pollution Permit. Uh, we started off last episode just kind of completing the first day and getting introduced a little bit to the game mechanics and stuff. It was uh, fun and really excited to play this game. I'm sorry. Bruce's back. We've taken her to the empty clinic. Why? This looks like a hazard in itself. Come quickly, follow me. He looks, he looks friendly. Just sitting there shaking his fist. No matter what. Mayor, absurdum. Here she is. Would you please check her? Who is this? What are you doing here? Matheo? This is absurdum. That's not a real name. Get out of here. The chemist from the capital. Absurdum, this is Matheo. Moonberry's witch doctor. Oh, he feels the competition. What is the meaning of this? You brought someone over from the capital? You've spent 16 years trying to cure your daughter and never have. Why would you do that? Theo, let's discuss this later. First, you have to explain what happened to her. But I made her drink some poison and now she's sick. I don't know what happened. We still don't know what's wrong with her. I tried everything I could, but it wasn't enough. Yes, you seem very competent. Sir, is there anything you can do? Please, help my daughter. Find out it's something really simple. We've had a cure for her for like 100 years. My neck feels weird. Uh, whenever there is an unknown symptom appears on the patient body, you will identify it first through diagnosis. Once you've performed the diagnosis successfully, you will know which disease the patient has. Well, that is how it works. Um, yep, that's her neck. Fantastic. And then we play a mini game. Okay, so we just uh, do a little bit of DDR in her neck. Just, some, just a little bit of light dancing. I've seen doctors do this before. It's true and tried. It's, it's something. Uh, when in doubt, just dance on somebody's neck, you know. My fingers slipped on that last button, but uh, we, apparently the bar is low. It's very easy to diagnose somebody's throat. I don't know what this guy's problem is. He's too busy shaking his fists instead of actually looking at the patient. How is she? Will she be alright? Yeah, she just, she just has a sore throat. The sunworm symptom. Yes, that's one of the symptoms, but the disease is far more complicated than we thought. Okay, well, we can still give her medicine. You want to help? I won't let that happen. We shouldn't use any unnatural drugs on real. But if it might help, unnatural drugs, where do you think I made it from? It's just an instant pot and some grass I found. Please, do anything you deem necessary for her sake. Okay, well. Sounds like consent to me. Root is still weak, Mayor. My advice is that we should use our traditional methods to find a cure, which haven't worked. We should keep doing that. I'm a witch doctor. <laughs> Using unnatural drugs from the capital might have side effects we're unaware of. Uh, the voice of reason. What if it can cure my daughter? He said subservient can only use ingredients available on the island to cure her. It doesn't matter where it came from. If that's what you think is best, dear. It could cure my cancer, but if it came from Brazil, then screw it. No. I hate that place. Do you really believe that? It's a good thing he's already shaking his fist. If you mess this up, you'll pay the price. There'll be a witch burning, except the witch is doing the burning. I'm confused. Do whatever you can for her, sir, please. Well, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm going to uh, make a potion, I guess. This place is shoddy looking at best. Alright, moon brine. Made from real brines of the moon. A strong mixture that kills germs and bacteria that cause sunworms. Wait, they're not parasites? They come from bacteria? This is very confusing. Uh. 
let's see what we can do here. Do I have anything that's request? I got a bear claw, luckily. Okay, just throw that in there. Of course, it's it's science. Don't question it. From the capital. Uh. Yep, yeah, we'll just throw in two snots from the slime and a bear claw. Just drink it. And it'll be science. Oops, sorry, kick cat. Comes out in a fancy little bottle and everything. You know, maybe the witch doctor is the only reasonable person around for questioning this. Oh, we got the lights and sirens going. There's an emergency. This chronic disease that's slowly killing her is not very urgent. Um, but she got a band-aid on it. She looks like she just had a trach removed, but whatever. Felt like I clicked it a bunch, but maybe I had to hold it down. All right, sit down, sit down. I don't know what your problem is. Just sit down. Oh, she's very satisfied. Thank you. I can't wait to get back home to Papa. Why do we have just broken like IV tubes? Like this is such a hazard. Ryu, my dear, are you feeling any better? Yes, I, I think so. This is going to really piss off the witch doctor. Thank goodness. The windows are boarded up. My lord. Oh, my little girl, you're finally cured. Do you feel strange at all? No, Mama. Never felt so good. Thank you, chemist. I have a name. We are profoundly in your debt. I'm glad to hear that. You. What exactly was in that bottle? Don't ask. You must have given her some suspicious stuff. Actually, <laughs> yeah. There's no way she could have been cured that fast. Still. Still lying, I see. I'll expose your little scheme. And now, Theo. Certainly is here to help. Why can't we work together to find a solution? But this kid's from the capital. Have you forgotten what they did to our island? Certainly not. The times have changed. After all, I'm the one asking for you're just too impatient, Mayor. Mayor looks like he could keel over any day. He just wants to see his daughter get better before he dies. We tried all sorts of methods to cure her, but nothing's worked. And if change can make everyone's lives better, who am I to refuse it? Ooh, so progressive. I'm disappointed in you. If, you're, if my commitment to this community means nothing to you, which it shouldn't, Feel free to ask the capital lackey for existence. Just don't come around to me for help. Well, as long as we can all make this a personal attack on him. It's right. He used to be such a pleasant chap. That's surprising. I'm afraid he seems to have taken a dislike to you. He's a very idealistic person. With no ideals. Wife, whatever, Mary, Mary Lee. Meryl, whatever, wife, you better be off home. And that rue gets a nest. Right. Have a good rest. She just does whatever he says. Yes, ma'am. Wow. This place, I just cannot get over this place. This is disgusting. Since rue will be in the clinic for a while, please keep it up. And I shall send a letter to the medical association about your accomplishments. I'm sure they'll be happy to know things progressing. Well, I think we're done here. I shall see you again soon. And I got paid finally. Let's see. Can't actually do anything to help her. Doggo. Uh, so we're just of our own accord right now, then, I guess. I feel like it would be a decent idea just to collect more. I'm sure we're going to need them eventually, right? So we might as well. Oh, oh, they came right at me. That fell in the water, but I guess it's okay.
Oops, clicked off the screen again. Oh, this is a problem. They need to like... I guess it's probably not really made for mouse, but they really need to like bind the uh, mouse to the screen, so I'll just accidentally click off like that. So you can't see the mouse, so I don't know where the mouse is if I'm getting close to the edge. Ooh. Serious. Which was an important part of uh, carrying that little girl, so obviously we'll probably need more. Not, I, I have no idea. But they have it, I want it. That's all that really matters. Okay. That seems like we should be able, be able to interact with that or something. some bear. I'll need your paw for the next time someone gets worms in their throat. The disease is apparently all too common. Lemongrass. Lemon, or lemongrass. Lemon balm. Lemon balm can actually make some pretty decent tea. From that one. Okay. Got another ball. I do see a bit of honey just hanging out there. Maybe we'll try adjusting some, seeing if that gives us, I would assume, a fair amount of energy back. It's just like what, sure, basically. There's no like sprinting or anything. This is just this is the speed you move. It's a pretty good speed. And I'm happy enough to see a bar which decreases your energy as you run around the oh something that was pretty annoying in Harvestella. But overall easy to get back, so. that I'm gonna act like get something that I might need and then be you know, disappointed in myself for not uh, not having picked up more of it when I could have no really okay just the apple juice okay Kat, what are you doing here you want over there or not? Make some room for your brother. Cats. These cats are a headache. Um, I think that's pretty much everything we can collect, unfortunately. It's a leaf down there, but it's, it's not. You can't reach it, I tried. Let's go try to collect some trees and stuff. I guess, oh, it's a sick man painting. Stay away from him. He might be contagious. Two hours. Perfect. Let's, let's go. Lovely. Oh, there are different people in here this time. That's kind of cool. Um, are we naked? <laughs> we seem to be naked. Which, I mean, I guess makes kind of sense for a bathhouse, but like, then why does it go in? I don't know. This is a strange town. They have strange rules here. I'm not trying to move into one culture and then say that it's not appropriate. Hey, 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 be good. Make room for him. Sorry. Kids. Hey, be nice to your brother. He's old. He's very old. Be nice to him. 
right side. There you go. It's a pretty nice and free way to get back. I mean, two hours really doesn't take that long. So this is not very nice. I love the hitboxes for this art. You don't need to be like pixel perfect. That can be really annoying sometimes. with the dog because we can't acknowledge the dog until we do that. I whistled. There we go. It's uh he likes the mushrooms. Does he like honey? I don't know. Do dogs like honey? Yeah he seems to. I would there must be things he like even loves then. Which is kinda cool. That'd be a bit much, really, but it's something I wouldn't be excited for. Not exactly sure what what all this wooden stuff. I would imagine upgrading our house, fixing our house. But we can be ahead of the game now. There's uh, better resources along the way that give us more. Just doing this every day, just kind of get by, will be quite a grind. are like more wood. Yeah. High tiered ones those definitely give a lot more. Not to mention it seems to be a higher chance for the copper. I think I have enough energy to do the big tree. That's okay. We'll go back to bed. The teleporting seems real nice. Uh, who are you? We're watching you. Mind how you behave. Fascist authority, okay. I see. Yes, for course. Good morning. Some people from the medical association have arrived at the time. They want to discuss something with you. Would you please follow me? There you are. I 
wasn't expecting you to be able to cure the mayor's daughter so fast. I must say, you're rather surprised with your achievements. I brought you all here to simply discuss what's next. Yes, I'm aware of that. Could you give us a little more explanation? As you're aware, your chemist successfully cured my daughter. Uh, now I've realized what happened to Rue could happen to any of my citizens. Our knowledge here is very limited. And that's precisely why we need a person like you, Absurdum. Of course you do. To assist us with your knowledge. If I'm not asking too much of you, I would like your permission to let Absurdum help for a while. So we can exchange our knowledge. And strengthen the bond between Moonberry and the Cap. Of course, Mayor. Our association would be glad to assist you. This cooperation could be a stepping stone for the both of us. Our priority is helping as many places as we can stay safe and healthy. Certum can stay here for as long as you need. Do you own me? Thank you. I off officially grant my permission for the Medical Association representative to reside and work in Moonberry. And I, as the delegate to the Medical Association, give Absurdum a mandate to help the citizens of Moonberry starting from today. Well, this is an important task, is now on your shoulders. Go and do what you do best. Congratulations. Well, you must excuse us. We have a train to catch. And a report to write about this milestone. It's going to be a long report. I might leave it to you, Murray. Come on, Colin. It's your job, and don't be so childish. Stop bickering, you two. We need to get going. Best of luck, I'm sorry. Don't let us and Mooberry down. Now, since you're officially staying here with us, we should discuss our next steps. I greatly appreciate all of the effort you put in for Rue. My wife and I will be forever grateful. I shall need to make some major changes in order to prevent such diseases taking hold in Moonberry. But, as you know, not all the Moonberry residents are fond of people like you, people from the capital. And in order to make changes to healthcare here, we need to start changing their perspectives. We will need to work extra hard to bring them around. Some of them may be stubborn, but I assure you, they're all good people. Why don't you introduce yourself around town? I'm sure they'll start to warm up you once they get to know who you are. Trust reflects how you're perceived as a chemist in Mooberry. A thumbs up icon indicates your current position in trust. Make a thumbs down affect the way villagers treat you. They won't talk to you, be able to trigger events around town. You can gain trust by successfully treating villagers who need help. Failing on treatments will lose trust. And this is why I think this game is really interesting. It's not just another tycoon game where you make stuff and sell things. Uh, it's it's about actually treating people and I assume fixing up the hospital. And then maybe you do sell potions too. They seem to have values, but there's like a medical diagnosis. Silly and... and you know, whimsical as it is, uh, it's, it's cool, it's different. I'm going to have a big X on it, okay? Give us token, I hope you. I'm Zal, managing the community quests. I can assist you by posting them with Town Hall. Okay, well, then would you post them in the Town Hall? Come, Doug, up. We have uh, people to meet. It's 6 30 in the morning, so that could be difficult. I don't think a lot of businesses and stuff are even open. Who was that? Uh, that's a cat. Fantastic. Here is Hannah's house. Hannah does not seem to be here, though she has an entire room just for clothes. There's Hannah at 7 o'clock in the morning. Unless Hannah was that cat. Shadows house, of course. Trash can's fantastic. Fast travel place, very nice. Who are you? A chemist. I'm Victor. What do you want from me? Wait. Sienna seems to like you. Sienna? You can't see him? But of course. Okay, you're crazy. You're straight up loot. That look on your face. It's for the first time you set eyes on an old seafarer. 
I'm a Leonor. That's for shopping the beach. Okay. Amor, say hi. Amor don't like Kaismist. You know, don't like Kaismist. Okay. Great talk. There's a tag on the gun scholar. It says Kips. This gun belongs to Zeke. Please do not feed. She has food. She's. She hangs out at the docks all day. How very cat. It's five already, okay. I think the cat counted. Derek. Look who it is, the refugee from the capital. Um, I'm pretty sure that's not the correct term for this. Just remember that I, Derek, am watching every move you make. Is a monastery? Skulls? What monastery is this? A book we can't read. Okay, well, I'm both impressed and disappointed. Impressed that there is one, and disappointed with how terrible it was. Here's the cemetery with people. The mayor's wife, who we've technically already met. Good day to you, sir. If anyone is rude to you, don't take it personally. I hope you like this simple town. And then Nova. A name I can actually read. Yes, uh, are you talking to me? Those manners are just what I would expect of someone from a dirty place like the capital. My name's Nova. With enough perseverance, I can fix your strange hair and outfit. Sorry, have you even been to the capital? How do you know it's dirty? I mean, it probably is. It's a capital. Look at this proper church. You can tell by the uh, shrine. Oh, hello there. Could you possibly help me out? Me? I'm grinding grapes. To be honest, this is the kind of thing that's too much for me. I've been trying to find a helping hand. I've had no luck so far. Will you be able to help me out? Great. You can sign up on the board near the entrance next time. What? Why don't I just do it for you? Of course, I'll return the favor. You're going to grind my grapes. But mine. You can switch it to free time doing part time work at the police station, church, or post office. Really? Part-time work takes two hours. You can order rewards. Oh, okay. So it's like an actual job we can do. Uh, let's talk to um, so Kelia, so so Celia, so Celia. Let's talk to sister. I understand that the Moonberry community is not very fond of you. Why not? Our church will always be open to everyone, even you filthy capital people. Um, I didn't really want to talk to her. Dear God, have mercy. In your names, okay, she's just kind of boring. I was just practicing a hymn. Oh, game favor. Uh, yeah, let's, let's do the grape grinding. Do we have to dance on the grapes? Which would actually make some more sense. Nope, we just. Attack as fast as we can, with plenty of time left over. And then we uh, fist bump the air. Okay. Oh, yeah, under twenty-five dollars is actually a lot of money for us. This is a significant. Amount. I got paid just as much to like save somebody's life. Put it in that kind of perspective. Newberry Cliff. Yeah, I love cliffs. So I'll go to end it when I give it up. Ah, Zeke. Definitely not Linus. Yes. Oh, the chemist. I'm Zeke. The town is lovely, isn't it? It's better than capital in every way. Okay. Great, I guess. And that's enough people that we can go. Tell the mayor, I guess. Go to the town hall. I suppose we could meet some others. Who are you? Cassandra. Greetings, I'm Cassandra, co-owner of the Mooberry Bathhouse and chief of wife. Hey, Bosman doesn't treat you harshly. He doesn't like strangers. 
Well, I don't, I don't like it, so I guess it kind of works out. If the fountain is dry. Osman. Chemist, I'm Osman, Chief of Police. Remember, I'm watching you. Right. Russo? Russo. Oi, what's the problem with you then? Nobody seems to like you much. I'm not afraid of you. This is my town. Don't you try anything in Russo's town. Very scared of you. So you've met the Moonberry residents. Great. Now, let's discuss the more important part, shall we? You might have seen that one. some of them aren't yet welcoming you with open arms. There's a reason for that. Truth. In the past, an accident occurred here. It's the fault of a chemist. It did such damage to some parts of the island that our native plants went extinct. In the wake of this, Moonberry banned chemists, especially chemists from the capital. Ever since, Theo's family have been our only source of healthcare. Everything was going brilliantly. We didn't need chemists to live our lives well. Until one day, Rue suddenly fell ill. Theo tried so many methods, but none of them worked. And that's when I realized it. There are problems we just can't solve ourselves. Maybe we shouldn't write off a whole group because of just one person. So I brought you here to see if you, a chemist, could, in fact, cure my daughter. And just as I expected you did. My citizens still bear the scars of what happened. But I hope they come to understand them better and regain their trust. I want to give you this. Fishing rod, fishing rod, fishing rod. It's called an approval badge. <laughs> okay. It gives you permission to explore more of the island so you can gather more materials. I do apologize if this is rather foreign to you. It's just one of our town's regulations. Your success in treating Rue is proof of your ability as a chemist. And if you can prove that you have other skills, I'll be happy to upgrade your badge to a higher level in the future. I'm looking forward to seeing you contribute to our town. Sweet, we got a blue check mark. This badge is earned you can prove yourself as a chemist. With this badge, you'll have access to certain areas around the island for your materials. The only person who can promote your badge is the mayor. You can prove yourself as a good chemist, you need to be assessed by the medical association. They can give you a letter of recommendation that will be useful to promote your badge. Oh, that's kind of cool. Shows display in there as well. A very neat mosquito. Um, so we take a job. Where's the post office? Here is the police department. Tap room. Coach house. I wonder if coach is like police department. The mayor's house. Okay. Actually, I want to go see about the lady that can upgrade our tools and stuff. What are we? Tree are we barking up there? Taking the wrong way to get there. Hearts and sparks. Hey, you need anything? What you doing with that big hammer? This is my place. I don't know if she's saying that offensively or welcomingly. I know, I know, it's a bit of a mess right now. If you're looking up great jewels, I can take care of that for you. Of course, I'll need you to provide the materials and cover the costs. Of course. Don't make this easy. Oi, so you're the chemist. Smaller than I expected. We've met twice. I'm Runehart, Rune, very soon to be legendary blacksmith. Oh my. Also, we actually have a fair amount of materials for the strength or sickle so you can make it more effective. We just need the money. Health expand increases your maximum health. Cauldron upgrade. Increase the capacity of cauldron and potion house. Okay, that's kind of cool. What if we could do that? I'm surprised we already have the materials. We just need the money. That's great, because we could do part-time jobs, apparently. Get cat, you're beautiful. Gippy. Yeah, it's not time to uh, get in the trust of cat, that's for sure. Oh, 
Let's go to the police station and see what jobs we can do there. And then the post office too. I like the little idea of mini games. I get a patrol around in a hat and beat people with a stick if they misbehave. Oh, hey, it's you. Yes, we have met. Got muskets. Got a moment? Well, we decided we need some assistance tidying up the woods. So, I'm looking to take some help. You see that board over there? Yes. You can sign up there if you want to start helping us out. Don't worry, we'll pay you for your efforts. Excellent. So no, that seems to be no to uh, patrolling. Walking a beat. Yes to cleaning, I guess. A specific minigame you can play while you're doing part-time jobs. You're checking the minigames to sort goods into the categories. You won't get any points if you put them in the wrong category. Okay. I see. Oops. It should be a lot easier than it feels like it is. Oh, okay, I only had a 20. Okay, there was a, the first time you walk up, you're just like, oh, what am I doing? That's okay. We, uh, we got 125. That's gonna really help pay for things. Like a new sickle. In fact, I think I have the money for it now. But I am actually more interested in bulletin boards. I got them displayed. There's nothing wrong. With post office? What is it? Coach, okay, sure. Rangers post. They have his house, yeah. He, he likes us. I mean, we've been inside these buildings. Uh, did we go inside the farm? Well, farm isn't the place we're looking for, anyways. Definitely not the clinic. Husband's house, Nova's house, not much. I guess. It did say post office, didn't it, huh? Okay. Very, very interesting. I mean, it could just be somebody's house, but. Maybe not. It's the mayor, of course. You? Oh, it's Hannah. Well, hello there, sugar. My name's Hannah. I know you're cute, but don't I look fabulous? Sure. Heck yeah, new sickle. Let's go. I don't care how poor I am. Iron sickle has been acquired. Took no iron whatsoever, just a bunch of rocks. Yeah, question that it's actually been acquired. Blacksmith upgrade required. Being able to sickle down plants would be actually quite nice. Okay. Ignore me, okay. Olive. Because I think it's yours. I'm the bath bathhouse owner. Olive, you should get cleaned up. You get dirty walking around this town. No, I don't think so. Oh, hello, chemist. My name is Dev. I work at the town hall. I've never seen you there. I'm the only postman in town, so please remember my name. Of course, I could be a totally different person sometimes. We need to be a different person. Let's call the dog over. Let's see, he's apparently hungry. Maybe we should give him. He's not getting the apple juice. That goes without saying, you know. But we will. It's chipping away at it, you know. Why does he have so many anvils? And a sword. Do mailmans need to be packing? This person seems to think they're a pirate. 
Oh, this is Dev's house. Okay. Didn't really answer my questions, I guess. They have a one with saw. It's way more sense. This house doesn't have a name on it. And you can't go into it. Okay. Ground floor. How many floors does the mayor need? Well, the mayor's not going hungry, I see. How are you feeling, warm throat? Ah, uh, it's you, thanks again. I'm Maria, the mayor's daughter. Nice to meet you. Well, we've met. I danced down your throat once. It's part of a medical process, don't worry. This is outrageous. Gotta eat the rich. Excuse me. Yeah, they even have a gate. Bridge into town is literally falling apart, but you have a gate. Well, I'm interested to see what exactly uh, post office travel is. I guess it's in the town hall, which I, okay, that makes some sense. Let's fast travel here, and then I just want to check out the new sickle. Obviously, we won't be up very long. Uh, is that really better? Oh, it did kill that faster. That was definitely faster, too. check out the, uh, the plants that were a little more difficult to cut. Oh, we're going to have a cutscene. Oh, because of this, right. Wait, they both rangers? They're married and work together? Gross. <laughs> hey, what's up? I don't know. Oh, it's nothing. We're just talking about this. Uh, that's the chemist. Need to make a bomb? The landslide's been blocking the quite some time. We used to forge materials further down the road, but now all the access routes are pretty limited. Clearing the way, you'll be able to travel further and find more materials for your potions, I suppose. If you have supplies, maybe you could help out. We'll need a few horses and probably a strong fishing net. How about you find someone in town who could lend us what we need? You would think they wouldn't trust me making a bomb. Unless it's the last person who's having issues with that. Troll, but oh yeah, you went down way faster. That was nice. That was very nice. And that was four strikes. Way better as well. Yeah, this upgrade is quite something. And I feel like we'll really need it if we're going to go into another area too. seems so much less of a grind. Alas, we'll go to bed. Pretty. Ooh. Can't put that. Also, the thought of being able to go fishing soon sounds uh, rather spectacular. This episode's gone on long enough, and we've accomplished quite enough as well. So we'll uh, get ready here and end the day. I guess we'll go to sleep. So, of course, I want to thank everybody for coming by. Let me know what you guys think of the series. I'm very excited to be kind of jumping into more and seeing a lot more of the gameplay aspects and all of that. I think this game's going to offer a, a very nice variety of different things to do. Uh, let me know your thoughts. I hope everyone is doing well. Please take care of yourself. I hope to see you again real soon.